day one of our Sainsbury's free £18 eating. It is breakfast time, but we've got an important mission to do first. We're in the car again. We're in the car, we've got to go out because we've got a light bulb out. I'm going to go and buy a light bulb for the little Peugeot. There we go. Um, might need more than that. More than a tenner for a light bulb? Yeah, it's 2023, the age of currency debasement. We only want one. We don't want to buy all the ones we've got in the shop. <laughs> Come on. Right, we're going to go buy a light bulb. We'll let you know how much it is. There we go, Lisa. One new bulb. And how much was that? Three pound ninety-five. Well, at least it weren't everything. Are you happy now? Come on, let's see a smile. It's better than twenty hey, quid. You've got some change. <laughs> right, let's get it fitted. I know you told your friend you're not okay. And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way. And guess you try to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away. But I've known you too long. It hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey as you fade away. As you fade away. Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Gotta build up on my thoughts sitting in and out This is the Sainsbury's cornflakes, these were 75 pence, pence For a 500 gram box, 16 servings which works out at 4.7 pence per serving And it's a 30 gram serving so we're going to measure 30 grams out and take a look. That's the front of packed traffic lights, all fairly standard, slightly high in salt, but they do add that to cereals quite a lot, don't they? Yeah. And this is the back of the packet. That's the ingredients, maize 93%, sugar, salt, barley malt extract, and some vitamins and other stuff there. That's the nutritional information. Plenty of glue on there, aren't they? Right. We're getting them. Back with that box, Lisa. What's a bit like that? So what we're doing way now. Yeah, but can we just take a look at some first? Let's have a look. Hmm. Look like cornflakes. Yeah, they do really, don't they? Yeah, let's see what a serving looks like then. There we go, that's 30 grams. Fair amount. Yeah, it's a bit like what you get in hotel hotel serving, yeah. isn't it? Into the equivalent to one of the little boxes. Oh, I don't know, that's a good question. I think when you buy the multi-packs, you know when you get the mini clusters of different Heinz, no, not even Heinz Kellogg's. Heinz Sorry. cereal. How <laughs> crazy. Follow us. <laughs> <I don't. laughs> I think it's the equivalent as when you buy the multi-pack of Kellogg's cereals, the little variety boxes. I think they're already measured out in 30 grams. What, you're not Please. supposed to have three of those? No. In one go? No, you're supposed to have one. Oh, that's a bit stingy. <laughs> that's why it's supposed to last a week. Let's get some milk in these and try them. What's your thoughts at home? They look pretty standard, standard. to me. Yeah. yeah. Don't think there's anything wrong with them. Time for a taste test. Yep. Go on then, Lisa. You give them I a try. Have to go first. Yeah. To be honest, they're perfectly fine. The way you'd expect from cornflakes. Perfectly fine. Absolutely fine. Crunchy. They are crunchy, yeah. Tasty. I think if you add those and Kellogg's in a blind taste test, you wouldn't oh, know. No. Have we got any branded ones? No. Frosties. No. 
they're not quite the same are they no. yeah totally fine 75 pence 4.7 pence a serving It'd be a big saving again the price of Kellogg's yeah we're gonna sit down and get this eaten we'll see you at lunchtime it's dinner time on our eat free from Sainsbury's voucher deal day one what did I say it's dinner time when I eat free from Sainsbury's voucher day one dinner time it's day one we'll start again <laughs> well <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Day one on our eat free from Sainsbury's voucher deal thing. Um, <laughs> what have we got first up for dinner today, Lisa? First up, we have got a cheese and tomato pizza. We're trying this Sainsbury's, Stamford what do they call Street. it? Stamford Street range, which is their budget own label, I think. Yeah. Um, that was. One pound two big. One pound and two pence. That's going to be. Where did you get that from? I don't know. One pound two big. I don't know. So that's fifty-one pence each. If we was to have half, I'm not sure how we'd get on with having half, but we'll see. Well, I'm not eating a whole one, so you are welcome to have. <laughs> to go with that, we have got this bag of salad, which was seventy-eight pence. 78 pence that's one pound 80 in total yeah. so it's going to be 90 pence a serving if you was to have half each i don't think i'll eat half a bag of salad no nah, it's quite a lot isn't it really half a bag of salad um a what's the fact. cooking in, what's the cooking times on that one um cooking times are nine minutes if you're cooking from chilled on gas mark seven and 12 minutes if you're cooking from frozen Let's take a closer look at the label and product. Because that looks as exciting as that. That's the front of pack traffic light system. And the, where are they? And the ingredients. Where's the nutritional information, Lisa? Yeah. Could you point us that one out? Yeah, that's the nutritional information. Let's take a closer look at this then. Do you want me to take it out? Yeah, take it out the wrapping. There's the sweet leaf salad. Now, I think our observations was that Sainsbury's seemed quite expensive for salad yeah is that a fair statement for us to make I think so yeah that's obviously our opinion yes. at this moment in time but we got you get a big box don't you from Asda for one is it one pound thirty ish yeah or one pound is 15. it one pound ninety nine in Morrison's yeah but the Sainsbury's stuff seemed a bit a bit expensive yeah Right, let's have a look at that then. There we have it. In all its glory. Yeah, it is a bit like that really, isn't it? You know. I need to remember to put the cardboard on. <laughs> yeah, don't cook it with the cardboard. Make sure you take the cardboard home if That's you're... Might uh, be mistaken. <laughs> there might be some uh, extra nutritional content in there. No, we probably we can't, can't say, say that. that. Yeah, we can't say that. Yeah, so make sure you take the cardboard, the cardboard on the yeah. tray off. You know what time it is. We're going to pop it in the oven today. We're going to whack it in the oven. We'll bring you back when it's done. Pieces out of the oven. It's all dished up. Let's take a look. I think we can agree it's a cheap easy lunch isn't it and I ten think minutes. 10 minutes 10 minutes 1.80 90 pence each if you have half obviously there is a bit of salad left over because we haven't had the whole bag um, but it, it is generally what you expect yeah you buy a one pound ish pizza your expectations is a one pound ish pizza so yeah let's try it and that was part of the objective what is the budget pizza like in the was it stamford street stamford street, stamford co. street co range yeah. from sainsbury's let's give it a try we'll let you know our thoughts so that's the pizza then yeah uh -huh. I think it's a bit more 
doughy than what I remember. We did the, what what budget pizzas did we do? Was it Asda? I think it was the Asda Just mm. Essentials pizza, wasn't yeah. it? It did cook in nine minutes, mm -hmm. like it said, from fresh. It hasn't, it's cooked nice on top. Yeah. And it's cooked nice and evenly on top. Yeah. And I did cook it Without a, burning. Without burning. And I did cook it on a pizza tray with holes in. Mm-hmm. But there's no crispy base. No. It is really soft. The base is really soft. Now, that might be... How it's, how it's meant to be. And it might be what some people like. Yeah. You know. But if you do want a crispier base, cooking this in nine minutes doesn't give you that. But I think if you if you left it in any longer, you can see where it is starting it to turn. It was starting. It did cook nice and evenly, though. I think it's cooked well, but if I'm going to be honest with you, I I feel some disappointment. I know it's it's, it's one pound two pence. Yeah. You know what? What do you actually go it's and say branded. about one pound two pence? It's not the five pound range that you can get. And Personally, I. Th I th think I'm a bit disappointed in that. When you compare it to, I'm, I'm sure as they do a deep pan pizza in a box for about a quid. Is yeah, that right? Yeah. Oh no, it's one pound twenty-five now. Mm, it, it's it's close-ish. You know for the kids? Yeah. One pound twenty-five. It's close-ish in four, price. Four cheese pizza or something. But I think when you have that, there's, there's a lot more to it. It's crunchy. It, yeah. it, it's still got a similar amount of topping. Yeah. I do feel disappointed Can with that. Can I just say the ones we buy that are frozen? This, and that, well, I know it's fresh. frozen, but at, but at the price point, yeah, it's still about similar. there. Yeah. This, this has left me underwhelmed. Right. I haven't gone away thinking, yeah, that, that's actually all right. It's good value for money. I can sing its praises. Big up Stamford Street. It tastes Co. nice. For me, mm. it's a little bit soft. Yeah. I would like a bit of a, a crunch, but there isn't anything. Taste-wise, it's nice. It's quick. It's cooked nice and evenly. So on that score, you can't fault it. It and is, if you're looking for a budget pizza, it's a nice price. <laughs> nice. Come on then. Let's try some of this. So this was sweet and crunchy, I think they advertised mm. it on the bag. That's all right. It's a mixture of different yeah. lettuce leaves, isn't it, with some carrot chucked in. And... Yeah. That's fine. That's a winner. And it's a good compliment to pizza if you're having... Pizza. So be honest, they're not wanting to be talking about food waste and things like that. I think that'll be a struggle to eat half of that. Yeah, I, I don't think I'll. I think that half. base needed to be a crispy base. Yes, it just needs that bit of oomph, doesn't it? A bit more. Yeah, a bite. Yeah. It is a bit. It, it's soft, but would you say it's softer? Is it chewy? I'd say, I'd say, well, when you look, if I can just, hopefully the camera will pick this up. It's just, it's too pliable, isn't it? Mm. It is, look, if you look, it's almost... It's fluffy. It's fluffy inside. But is that the problem? It's almost like, just like a slice of bread. Yeah. A slice of bread with some cheese on. Yeah. You know. Personally, it's not for me. And I'm going to agree it's not for me. And I'm disappointed to say that because of the one pound, two yeah. pence, which and is something yeah. we're always trying to push the value yeah. and say in supermarkets, you know, keep, keep the value keep, range yeah, in there. Right. I and don't think it's worth it. A lot of the value range me. items are really good, but, but just this one. And don't forget, we have said in the past, oh, we're not happy with this, but other people have said, yeah, I absolutely love that. And I'd be interested to know in the comments if there are people that's had this particular yeah. Stamford Street Co. pizza. And love it. And they say, yeah, actually, we love it. Yeah. Don't know what you're talking about. Why are you saying that? For me, And maybe other people worked. will say you should have just left it in a few more minutes. I think it would have turned. Yeah. I really do. You know, when you look at... That's another... I, I don't think that's far off. And then you, no. you've ended up with a cremated pizza. Yeah, that's why that isn't ended And you'd still have the... Soft on yeah. under. Um, Unfortunately, this one's not for us. I'm rating wise then. 
I'm going to go for a three because I think at one pound, two pence, the price is good. There's other things that you could buy. Value, yes. The price is good. But I think you you, you could have done something else. Yes. And I think other supermarkets, I'm sure we paid 79-ish pence for the Aldi or Lidl one. Mm. We've had a pizza from Aldi or Lidl and we rated that quite yeah. good. I think I'm going to, yeah. Well, I think I'll match one of three. I think the price, if you're after a budget pizza, is good at £1.2p. Yeah. But yeah, it's just not quite there, is it? Yeah. It's just... We're definitely going to be hoping for a good tea time, which we've got chicken, chicken stir-fry. Chicken stir so hopefully that'll that that's <laughs> going to fill us up and, and rescue the day. We'll see you later. Okay, Lisa, do you want to talk us through our tea time delight from yep. our Sainsbury's freebie shopper? We're having chicken stir-fry. So here we've got... Chicken. Chicken breast fillets. Yeah, that's good. We're not sure how much they are, so the price will be on the screen. Yeah. And we have got some mixed vegetable stir fry. This was actually substituted, wasn't it? It wasn't the one we first it wasn't, wanted. No. no, so that's substituted. So we'll pop the price of that on. But I think these was on a meal deal, wasn't they? Yeah, can you hold that up? That's it. That one. Give us a and smile that. as well. They that's were £2.50. Sell them, sell them. <laughs> they were £2.50 on the meal deal. So we just had to buy the chicken extra. So here we've got Chinese style stir fry sauce. And that's it. We're gonna whack this in the frying pan and we'll be back when uh, it's done. That's my catchphrase. Well, I'm not doing the washy bit, so. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's go. What's the plan with this then, Lisa? Talk us through it. So we've chopped the chicken and we've placed it in the frying pan and we're gonna seal all that off and start that cooking. So we're going to pop in the vegetables when this is all sealed off and we're going to continue cooking for about five to six minutes. Then we're going to add in our stir fry sauce, give it a good old mix up and cook that for another couple of minutes. Then we should be good to go. Chicken's all sealed off now, so now we're going to open our veg and we're going to stick all that in. Spread it all out, get it all cooking. And we'll just have to wait for that to soften up now. This is how it's looking now. We've cooked the veg now for about five to six minutes. So now we're ready to add in our stir fry sauce. <laughs> Good job it weren't open. <laughs> Else we'd be scooping it off the floor. <laughs> Wouldn't we? Is the packet slippery, Lisa? Yeah. Well, I'm going to have to find the scissors. Well, it was a good job. I didn't get into it, wasn't it? Else it would have been leaking everywhere. Okay, so there we go. That's what it looks like. Gravy. It does look like gravy, yeah. doesn't it? There we go. So we're just going to give that a mix up. Get it all mixed in well. And we're just going to leave that to cook for a couple of minutes. And then we should be well, good to nice go. It's got a nice smell to it. It has, hasn't it? Mm. It smells fruity, isn't it? Ginger I'm picking up. You reckon I'm picking up mm. fruity? That's the front of pack traffic lights for the sauce. And the ingredients and nutritional information. What have we got in there? Water, soy sauce, sugar, sugar, rice, vinegar, garlic puree, ginger, ginger puree. Mm. Yeah, I can smell that. Five spice. Yeah, that's what it'll be. 
Well, it smells all right. It looks all right, doesn't it? Yeah. Quite looking forward to that. Yeah, it looks good, doesn't it? Yeah. Better than dinner. Better than dinner, yeah. What do you think? Do you yeah. think this is going to make up? I think so, don't you? Yeah. Definitely. We'll bring you back when it's ready. Yeah, I'm about to fade away. Cause every time I wake up, I feel like it's Monday. Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain. All of a sudden, I don't look at anything the same way. Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray. I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient. This smells Lovely. really good. Yeah. It really does. It really does. Looks well, quite nice and healthy as well, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, the vegetables have um, gone down in size quite a lot, haven't yeah. they? Yeah. Mm, that's really nice. That's tasty. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, you can taste the spices. Five spice. Ginger. The ginger is definitely garlic. in there. The garlic's in there. That is quite nice, that. I think it's a nice, wholesome, like, one-pan meal, isn't it? Yeah. To be fair. Yeah. I do like a good stir fry. Mmm. It's got like a kick to it as well, that sauce, isn't it? That's nice. Yeah. That is probably one of the better ones, because a lot of the time you buy stuff like that and it's bland tasting. Yeah. They've made quite a good mix there, I think. Yeah. What was it, the Chinese? Mmm. Yeah, I quite like this one. This is nice. Mmm. Yeah. I rate this really well. Mm. And we just did fan fries with chicken. It's not that bad price, really, is it? Because the sauce and the stir fry veg was on two for two pound fifty. It was on a meal deal, wasn't it? It was on a meal deal, yeah. That I rate that. I think I, like that. That, I think I'm going to enjoy this tea. Yeah. So round up for the day, the breakfast cereal it was good. No faults with that at all. Yeah, that was fine. The dinner. It was a bit of a flop, wasn't it? It just wasn't yeah. our dinner, was it? That pizza wasn't for us at all, was no. it? Tea time. It's lovely. Or dinner. That's made up for it, that yeah. has. Yeah. Yeah, it's I, a nice, wholesome meal with loads of It is. I'd rate, I, I'm going to rate that as a seven and a half. I'd probably go eight. I can't seven like and it. a half for that one. Yeah. It's definitely resurrected the day, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's resurrected the day. Overall, then, what are you going to give the day overall? Five. I was going to go six. I'm going to say five. I'll say five with you. Well, you don't have to. I'll say five and a half. It was the pizza. <laughs> yeah. It, the it was just the pizza, down, was just it? a bit of a disappointment. Yeah. Which is unfortunate, because I wanted it to be nice. Yeah. And it, it wasn't not nice, it just wasn't... Nice. It just wasn't crispy enough. This is day one over. We're back again with day two in our next video. We look forward to seeing you in that one. Goodbye. Bye.